Hello from Slovenia again. <clears throat> I will try something today. Uh, my canvas, this is 12 inch round canvas, dropped on the floor and I got this uh, <clears throat> um, see there is a it te teared or how can I say so I taped it on the back oh my god this do have it covered or how can I say steady and I will use try art crackle ground this is crackle paste kind of and I will leave it to dry and then I will pour over that crackle thing <laughs> I don't know how it will look but let's find out together uh, it says just to pour it on and tilt it. I maybe will not tilt it. I will just pour. Let's try. I did one and I realized if I have less paint, uh, less of this crackle ground. It's um, cracks are smaller. If I have more of it, cracks are bigger. I will just do that to pop the air bubbles, and I will just spin it out. to cover the whole canvas. Let's move it a little to that side where I need this to go over because I want to have my sides looking like that too. To have some cracks on the side too. Maybe some of you will think you can just mix your paints bad and you will get cracks, but it looks different if you have crackle paste on them, if your pour just cracks because of because you did something wrong, so let's see what will happen I'll just do that okay it's covered and now I will take it to the place to dry maybe I will just torch it once more Because I did shake it before I pour it on and now this lady can go to the drying rack. So this is how it looks dry. The crackle paste is dry and I didn't manage to cover this where my uh, when it was where it was tear apart or how can I say but I believe that when I will pour on this it will be okay and I will use Amsterdam pearl paints I play with those quite a lot lately these are those paints I have pearl violet pearl green, pearl yellow, pearl blue and pearl red and I have my pearl white mixture and I have some black and I will layer my cup and I will start with some pearl red, some pearl yellow, some pearl green 
and those are all white when they are wet pearl blue and pearl violet and this is my pearl white mixture for maybe some effects and I will add some black here and I will repeat the process black and white. The lines did get a little wonky because of the crackle paste, but I wonder how this will dry. And here where is white will be a gradient of all the pearls. And I can't wait to see this one dry. Stay tuned for the dry results. So here is a close-up. I'm really happy with the outcome. Uh, maybe some of you will think that it just cracked poor, but it's so different if you just do a wrong mixture and you're poor. Um, cracks because those textured cells, stones or how can I say they are gorgeous for my taste. I was thinking to maybe resin it but I don't know because I kind of like that it's textured. That was my plan. Okay. Tell me in the comments if you want to see me do more of that kind of pours. And don't forget for the premiere, December, this little piggy pigment switcheroo. Uh, come to chat with me if you want and see what I will create or join me on the next one. 
Thanks for watching and bye.